Race three, the Day to Dream Racing Syndicate maiden plate for the Phillies and Mays has been won by number two, Pineapple Mint Green, the daughter of Gimme the Green Light, stepped up uh, over the 1,400 metres and ran on to win well. Well done to Zibo Zisile Jevo. He receives his 1,000 rand. Thank you to Hollywood Bets and Cape Racing. Elder Dome, the jockey aboard. Elder, well done. Thank you, Vicky. She uh, seemed to get there a little bit more comfortably over the, the 1,400 metres, didn't have to take so long to, you know, didn't have to be so sharp off the, the bat in the straight. Yeah, listen, I think I learnt a lot from her last time I sat on her. She gives you the impression that she really wants to tow, but today she went down beautifully, you know. I worked the last week and I think Mr. Sands had on the bat and he just kept her boiling over. Her work couldn't have been much better. It was just a matter of her bringing it to the course and uh, I really think she's a smart sort of filly. There's no idea what she's doing yet, and I just, I just gave her some encouragement, just so she understands that there's still a bit of work to be done. But in the stages where she does do it, she does it really smartly, and I'm quite impressed by that. And uh, the penny hasn't dropped yet, but that's nice, though, because uh, the penny hasn't dropped and she's doing it things the right way. She could have probably won her previous two starts, but still learning what it's about, and no better place to learn but where the maidens are. And uh, she's done this in nice style today. Things didn't really go away. Very sedate gallop. Surprised to see that at this course at this stage in the, of the year, but... Uh, I pulled out for a nice smooth run. She gathered momentum quite nicely. And uh, like I say, she done it in stages. Not all there yet, but really nice that the way she does it when she is doing it. So uh, I was quite encouraged with that. Aldo, well done for the win. Thanks so much. Thank you, Mr. Sands, for giving me another opportunity on her. Wouldn't mind staying with her because I think she's going to keep building on what she's done here today. She keeps coming forward like she's shown here that she has nicely today. It was an hard run for her, so I'm pretty sure she'll improve quite nicely. to the Rowitz and Kalmanson. I think you've got a pleasant fully on your hand. I'm sure you'll enjoy it. Indeed, well done. Thanks so much. Next up, Eric Sands, a condition of number two, Pineapple Mint Green. And uh, Eric, with, when it comes to a passion for horse racing, it's often inherited through the generations and no different here with Pineapple Mint Green. Yeah, this is a really a proud moment for me. The Kalmanson has been in racing for generations and now we've got the next generation, the Rowitz and Kalmansons, Diana, Charlotte, uh, Alice and John all over the world. Uh, thank you for letting me train your filly. She's a lovely filly. I hope we go great places together. It's really an honour and a privilege to train for the family. It is indeed. And listening to Elder, you know, she's, it's in the early stages of her, her career, but um, she seems the way she goes about her work, she'll go on from here. Yeah, and it looks like she'll want a little bit further too. Uh, they went very slowly there today. I thought we were in trouble getting caught on the rails there, but held up about his time and he kept it nicely balanced and she responded well. Well then for the win and also lovely to have the next generation up and coming. Well done. Yeah, that's really lovely. Thank you. Lovely to hear from Eric that it's a proud moment for him. And uh, as mentioned, the passion of horse racing is most certainly inherited through the generations and no different here with uh, the Cummins and the the. The Rowitz, uh, lovely to have them. Well done to Fast Fontain, stud in breeding number two, Pineapple Mint Green, well bred daughter of Gimme the Green Light, who most certainly will go on from here.